Hello, I'm Ivan. We're gonna be working on improving your tennis movement through three different exercises. For exercise number one, the main purpose of the exercise will be to improve your first steps. Tomas is here to show us how it's done. Okay. So Tomas is going to begin by split stepping on the left side of the ladder, taking the first step over the ladder. We put the cones inside the ladder so we know not to go inside the ladder. We're gonna split step, first step over the ladder, on the run, load and swing. Here we go. Split step, one, two, load, swing. He recovers a bit, split, one, two, load, hit. Third cone, split, one, two, load, hit. Next one, split, one, two, good. Split step with a white base, one, two, hit. Split step, one, two, hit. We're gonna do that three times for one set. Ready, here we go, second round, going, split, one, two, load, hit. Split step with a white base, load, hit, really good. One, two, load, hit. Stay low when you transfer. One, two, good. Split, one, two, load. Big split, one, two, boom. Cover a little more space, one, two. Good, one more, one more. Split, one, two, that's it. Okay, last one, here we go. We go split with a white base, one, two. Little time between the split step and the first step. Split, and you go right away, that's it. Split, and you go right away, good. Here we go, split. Stay low when you transfer, split, one, two, boom. Okay. For exercise number two, the purpose of the video will be improving your adjustment steps. The purpose of your adjustment steps is to improve the distance between your body and the ball before you hit the ball. So it's a very common mistake that they're reaching for the ball when they go for the ball. So for example, many times they're hitting the ball reaching like that or uh, stretching with the back too much. So now the purpose of this is to be in better position with your body before you hit the ball. Tomas is gonna show us how it's, how it's done. Okay, so here we have red cones and yellow cones. We're gonna have two steps between each cone. Two steps going forward and two steps going to the side. Just two simple steps. One, two, and here, one, two. Tomas is gonna be starting working on adjustment steps on his forehand side. Here, Tomas, go ahead. So we're gonna split step behind the yellow, get sideways, adjust, hit, recover, split, Adjust, hit, recover. Split step, adjust, hit, recover. Good, adjust, adjust, recover. Split step, recover. And now he's gonna continue it, going this way with his back end. Here we go, split step, get on the side of the ball, good, hit. Split step, get on the side of the ball, hit. The red cone is the ball, split step, get on the side of the ball, hit. The strength should go right over the red cone. Split step, get on the side of the ball, hit, good. So here, we're gonna do this there and back three times for one set, and we're doing a total of three sets. Here we go. Split step, get on the side of the ball, hit. Good, reminder, the red cone is the ball. Okay, good, right there. Split step, adjust, 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 hit. Split step, adjust, 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 hit. Split step, adjust, hit. Now back ends, here we go. Ready, split, get on the side of the ball, load, hit. Split step, adjust, adjust, hit. Perfect, adjust and hit, good, here we go. Split step, adjust, adjust, one more. Split, hit, good. One more, here we go. Hit, okay, split step, turn the hips right away, good. Split step and turn the hips as quickly as you can. Good, get sideways, that's it, get on the side of the ball. Split step, get on the side of the ball and hit, good. Create that space. Here we go, create the space and you hit. Split step, create the space and then you hit. Split step, create the space and you hit. Good, get on the side of the ball, hit. Split step, create the space, good. For the third and last exercise, the purpose of it will be to improve the quality of your split step. Common mistakes in this is that people don't go low enough on the split, they're too tall when they land or the heels go on the ground, which makes the reaction poor. We, gotta, we have to remember that the purpose of the split step is to help your reaction go into the ball. And we should always split step right before your opponent hits the ball. Here, we will do 10 split steps. 10 split steps equals one round, and we will do three rounds for each set. Here we go. We'll go. Feet together, split step, feet together, split, feet together, split, feet together, split. Five, six, good, get low on the split, good, on the toes, two more, 
10. Okay, rest for a little while. Now we're gonna show you a side view of what it looks like. Okay, here we go. Ready and begin. Feet together, split. Notice guys how the heels don't go on the ground. Okay, he spends little time on the ground before he returns. The position of the legs and upper body should be a half squat. Half squat right there to be able to react to the ball efficiently. Okay, and we'll do one more round, Tomas. Now when you can speed it up, please do so, okay? And four, five, six, good. Eight, nine, and that's 10 for one set, perfect. The frequency of these exercises will have to be three times per week for four weeks to be able to see a difference in your movement. Reminder that in every exercise, there is a difference between sets, rounds, and reps. Every exercise is three rounds, and that equals one set. We will do three sets for every exercise.